How's it going everyone? So today I'm going to talk about eating 500 calories a day. How much weight will you lose? So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Also, if you're interested in online personal training from me, simply comment below in the comment section. I will get back to you guys with more details. So if you eat 500 calories a day, you will completely starve yourself and your body will go into starvation mode. Now, what will happen is that your body won't actually lose weight. It will slow down your metabolism and you will probably stay the same weight. Now, this is an awful approach if you're trying to lose weight. If you want a better approach, I will give you guys some tips below. Again, the tips I provide always give you the fastest results to lose the weight. I never tell you the slowest ways, only the fastest ways to hit your goals. So how can we lose weight? Another thing too that I want to talk about is that by eating 500 calories a day, if you notice that you are losing weight, chances are that you're dropping muscle mass. So I see it all the time. People will be losing weight off very, very, very low calories and they'll be like, yeah, I'm losing weight. I'm losing weight. Yet their stomach, their chest, their back, their legs, they don't look any leaner. They just look smaller, more soft more bloated and they don't look very good but they keep doing that and what happens is their strength in the gym plummets like this S determining your strength or maintaining your strength is an amazing example of maintaining muscle mass what you want to do is maintain your strength when you're losing weight by doing this you will maintain muscle mass if for some reason your strength is dropping fast in the gym that means you're losing muscle mass that means your calories are too low. You need to raise them back up. And that's what a lot of people experience, you guys. So here's some tips how to lose weight fast. Tip one, exercise at least 45 minutes to one hour a day. This will put your body in great conditioning and keep off the fat. Trust me, this is a good approach if you want to lose weight. You don't have to go to the gym and run on the treadmill either. What you can simply do is join clubs, play sports, a much funner way to lose the weight in my opinion. Plus by joining clubs, you meet people with like-minded uh, minds like you and you may make a few friends as well. So there's no need to run on the treadmill for an hour. You can join squash, basketball, football, soccer, floor hockey, all of them amazing. I love playing floor hockey, you guys. Uh, basketball's pretty fun, I don't mind it. I like playing soccer too, football, flag football, uh, handball, stuff like that. All fun exercises too, way funner than just running on the treadmill. But if you enjoy running on the treadmill, that's awesome too. Second tip, watch what you eat. This is probably the most important tip. What you eat is what you become. If you eat healthy foods, then your body will look good. If you divulge into unhealthy and processed foods and that's all you eat, then your body will show it. So make sure you're watching what you, you're eating. That isn't to say everything has to be 100% healthy. That's not what I'm trying to say. You can do an 80% healthy approach and a 20% dirty approach to give your life some balance. This is what I do personally and it gives me good balance and allows me to live a normal life. But if we're doing that, you need to track your calories. And for anyone, I recommend they track their calories. Tip three, consistency. Rome wasn't built in a day. Don't expect you to look like a supermodel after a day. It takes time, weeks, months, years to get a Greek body looking um, like that. So uh, give it time and you will be proud of yourself eventually. So end of video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please like the video and share it. Thanks again.